what it do it's your girl q and i have a weekly message for you taurus <laughs> some new rise of the venus so if you're new to my channel welcome don't forget to hit the subscribe button and if you're returning what's so good what's so lovely these are going to be your weekly messages from april 15th to april 22nd so don't forget to uh take one of these links and leave the rest and we'll get straight to it also i will be posting on uh Taurus Fairy channel, so don't forget to subscribe to that channel, okay? And I also will be posting your mid monthly messages, so you guys have two really like three readings, okay? Because you know, I love my Tauruses and y'all always showing out, okay? So, yes, okay? So, yeah, don't forget to watch those videos, okay? So, you guys could be working a lot, okay? With these, like, get it straight to it. I'm getting straight to the messages, but you guys could be definitely working a lot, okay? Working a lot, okay? Messages for Taurus from April 15th to April 22nd. Messages for Tauruses. Tauruses. I'm hearing carriages, carriages and horses. I don't know why. Page of Cups. Okay. Ten of Pentacles. Okay. Seven of Wands. The Queen of Pentacles. The Page of Wands, the Eight of, um, no, not the Eight. The Strength, okay, the, the Eighth of the Month or the Eighth Date can be important. It's the first of the month. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Yeah. That can be important, okay? That song, you can listen to that song. You can be an old school, old vibe, okay? But you're like also new school as well, too. Classic. Classic things can be um important. Wild thoughts, Rihanna. July eighth, October seventh. Messages for Taurus. Messages for Taurus. King of Pentacles. Okay. Six of Swords. Excuse me. Queen of Wands. Okay. Um, so overall we only have one major arcana so far, okay. Um yeah. Mm -hmm. Heavy emphasis on security. Okay, you guys can have Leo in your chart. Okay. Six of Pentacles clarifying the page of cups. Okay, ten of wands clarifying the ten of pentacles. Look at that. Ten ten, baby. 10 10 yeah a completion of a cycle angels you could like angel angel numbers you could have an angel numbers tatted okay queen of swords clarifying the seven of wands okay seven of swords clarifying the queen of pentacles okay uh oh eight of one eight of cups clarifying the page of wands seven of cups clarifying the strength five of pentacles clarifying the uh, king of pentacles Nine of Pentacles clarifying the Six of Swords and the Five of Swords clarifying the Queen of Wands. There could be another party, uh, somebody competing with you, okay? Um, definitely somebody could be competing with you, okay, this week. Um, because the Queen of Wands at first clear um like clarified by the Five of Swords, definitely, okay. Cause somebody could be somebody who has a Jezebel spirit, okay, like envious, evil, three 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 could be very significant, okay. Queen of uh, Wands fell on the Queen of Pentacles. Somebody could be comparing yourself or comparing somebody else to you. Okay, okay. All right. Yeah, somebody's definitely competing with you and they're lying about something with the Seven of Swords. My two least favorite cards with these, next to these, I'm here next to these women. It's like women competing with another woman. A woman competing for something or a man, a, a man in their divine, like in their... And in their, like, what in their divine right mind? Something, somebody's not in their divine right mind. 887 could be angel numbers that you keep seeing. Okay. 777. All right. All right. 777. Okay. Oh. Somebody's definitely watching you online. I almost put the seven of cups with the queen of pentacles the queen of pentacles could be watching you online or you have an online presence okay because you are an earth sign all right and there could be a fire sign that is um trying to take advantage of a situation or you have these good energies or you have these star-like energies like you have good energy with you somebody's trying to compete with you this week somebody is lying and trying to compete with you this week 
because they feel humiliated by you. They could have tried to humiliate you and they feel humili humiliated by you because you're doing better than them. Ooh. I'm hearing financially. You're doing better than them financially, spiritually, physically, emotionally. You're doing better than, than them in all aspects. And this person could be very envious of this. But anyways, enough about this person. Because it's been five minutes and this person just, ugh. All right. We have emotional, innocent focus. You're focusing on your um, social justice. You're focusing on you receiving something, okay? You know, doing good, okay? Focusing on your material success. Focusing on your wealth. Focusing on working on you working, okay? It's like an overload on you, but you're working. You're doing the damn thing, okay? And there's a level of you, like, you know, you're doing the work, okay? You're, you're stepping on these bitches' necks, okay? Or these men's necks, okay? Let me stop cussing. You're stepping on these women's necks. You're stepping on these men's neck, necks, okay? you stepping on a man, okay? Heavy stepper. Heavy stepper. Heavy stepper. That, that, that's going to be part of the type of, title, too. Typo? Be mindful of uh, typos. I mean, I be, I be messing shit up all the time, but when I see it, I fix it. You know what I mean? I'm hearing there's no hard feelings when it comes to the situation. There's no hard feelings, but somebody has hard feelings. Okay. October 10th could be an important date. Okay. June 10th, 2010. Okay. October 7th, heavy Libra energy. Heavy Libra energy. July 8th, I already said that. August 7th. Okay, August 8th, May 6, 2009, May 6, period, June 9th, September 5th, June 5th, all right, but there's a level of your energy, I don't know what you're doing, but you stepping on these motherfuckers next, okay, the signs I do see is Taurus, okay, Libra, Sagittarius, Leo, Okay, another Sagittarius, Libra, Scorpio, Cancer, Leo, Pisces, Capricorn, Scorpio again, another Leo, Taurus, Aquarius again. Okay. Definitely. All right. You, you're doing good. So I, don't, I don't know what you're doing, but you're doing good. Okay. And somebody can be de very much so, um, also devilish. I was just, I'm hearing devilish. Like they're very toxic or sinister. Like I said before in your video, somebody has sinister thoughts. They're very sinister and because you're very good at this business thing. Okay. They have ulterior motives when it comes to your business. Don't know what that means. Okay. So for instance, somebody is, you have some, you do something online, Somebody's watching you, but they don't support you. They don't like you. They're envious of this, so they're trying to compete with you energetically. But you don't see this. They're trying to compete with you energetically on a 5D level, okay? Somebody's in their ego, okay? We do definitely need our ego, but this person is very much so too much in our ego. Especially online, they could be very delusional. Like, everybody's delusional, but, like, some, per some there's somebody, like, a specific person that's delusional for no damn reason, okay? They're not receiving their manifestations because they're trying to compete. And you're not competing. You want everybody to win. It's, it's, it's weird. The, you have, what's understood don't got to be explained. And um, the, if, you, if they don't get it, if nobody gets it when it comes to the situation, they won't, it won't get got. When it comes, they won't attain something. They won't attain something. Okay, and somebody feels left on the cold because you, uh, because of your energy, because you feel secure. You're very dependable. They feel out left on the cold, or there's a level of you feeling um, helpless when it comes to your um, money. But you're steady working on something. You're steady securing the bag. You're steady saving. Okay, budgeting can be very significant. You're budgeting. Okay, you're paying yourself first. Okay, you're doing your homework, okay? The most important thing to do when you get your checks is pay yourself per first, okay? And that's on per. You're enjoying the fruits of the, your labor, of the labor that you're getting, okay? You're no longer putting other things first. Although, yes, you are, but at the same time, you're paying yourself first because nobody wants to be left, in, you know, in that cycle, okay? Nobody wants to be left 
I don't know what that means, but that can be important. No person left behind. July 22nd to August 22nd could be a important day. She could be dealing with the Leo or have Leo in your chart. Or those days are going to be um, uh, hi hi highlighted for you. A highlight of your life. The highlights of your life. December 13th to December 21st. September 12th to September 22nd. Okay. May 1st to May 10th. September 23rd to December 21st. Okay. September 12th to October 12th. December 13th to January 9th. February 9th to February 18th. June 21st to September 22nd. Okay, February 19th to February 28th, July 22nd to August 22nd, like I said. Okay, November 12th to November 22nd, August 12th to September 11th, April 21st to April 30th, January 30th to April 8th, September um, 2nd to 11th, okay, March 11th to April 10th, and January 20th to January 29th, okay? A lot of good energy for you, baby. Material comforts. You're standing. You're standing up for yourself, or you're doing something that is like undeniable, undeniable. Something that's undeniable. Like you're working on something. Somebody feels off. Like there's a level of somebody wanting you to feel off. You block this person. You don't feel off, or you're no longer going to. <laughs> We're manifesting positivity, positive love, light. Okay, good energy. Somebody was one was one was once trying to make you feel off, make you feel low, and you could it could it could have been working, but you're no longer feeling that way anymore. With the Eight of Swords, something's coming in fast. What is this Eight of Swords? Seven of Swords, yeah, Seven of Swords twice. What's the Seven of Swords? Betrayal, deception, okay, ulterior motives. What is the Seven of Swords? This came out twice. Isolated, calculating, Queen of Cups. This Queen of Cups energy is trying to make you feel um, uh, foggy, lofty. They're trying to make you forget something. 1987 can be an important date. Queen of Cups, Aquarius. Well, damn. trying to work with you spirits is trying to work with you so you can like alchemize energy so you can like make money for like you have to believe in yourself or you you are believing in yourself and there's a level of you kind of doubting yourself at the same time don't doubt yourself something is going to work in your favor you have a lot of power within you with the ace of pentacles like i was just for example i was just about to accept the shift okay you guys can be accepting change and accepting a shift, okay? A, an energetic change, okay? I was just about to accept a shift, but I don't want to edit the video. I'm doing a video for you guys. 777. Did I already say that? 777 with two seven of swords and seven of wands. To make more money, seven of cups as well too. We have four sevens. I already did say that. I'm, I'm trying to make more money. I got to make more money so I can make these payments. All right? You know what I mean? But if I'm doing a video right now, that means it's not it's not meant to be. But best believe there's more shifts coming. You're accepting a shift. With the Nine of Cups. Yeah, something definitely, definitely coming in. All right? Something's definitely coming in. All right? The slowest moving night in the deck, but... It's, it's got a lot to offer. The chariot and the will of fortune, okay? This could be an energetic shift. An energe a major energetic shift is coming in for you. All right, major shift. King of Cups. I'm hearing Should Have Wore Your Bonnet. Um, Drop the low, I'm coming. 
already know it's coming for me, girl. It's truly a blessing. You can make all the mess that you want. With the Nine of Cups popping out, showing his face with the Nine of Cups already out. Yeah, somebody thinks you look good. They want to come to you. Okay, they want to come to you. They keep dreaming about you as well, too. Somebody's dreaming about Um, What the fuck? I don't know why I'm hearing White and W. Millie. Murder on my mind, okay? Somebody wants to murder that punama. They just working a lot. To the ones, they feel burdened without you. Five of Swords. I'm not talking about the fist. This is just, I'm just, you know. Anyways, messages for Taurus, okay? What's going on for Taurus this week? For April 15th to April 22nd, messages for Taurus. 6-9 can be an important number, or you know what I mean. Be mindful of getting pregnant now. Queen of Wands. With the world. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody's toxic. Somebody could have a uh, Capricorn moon. They watching you. They paying attention to you. They paying attention to the words you're saying. But you blocked this person or this person blocked you. I don't know what it is. What's going on with you guys? What's going on for Taurus this week? What's going on? Oh, what's this nine of wands in reverse? You're no longer letting this person play you. And this person sees this person likes that you're no longer doing this. Okay, with the high <laughs> with the hangman in the uh, the sun. Somebody can be high. Smoking. Speaking of smoke, my damn sage went out. Sagittarius placement could be Sagittarius. They're like they 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 about business. About business. This is a man's world. This is a man's world, right? They lie. No, it's a woman's world. Who run the world, girls? And don't be going under the debate under the comments. Okay, this is a woman's world. We birth y'all. These bitches is my sons. You can be doing with the Sagittarius. Nicki Minaj is Sagittarius. And I just said Sagittarius too. With the King of Swords. Okay. Well, these bitches is my sons. And I'm going to go and get some bids for them. If I had it, I will pull it out and piss on them. Alright. You guys could be definitely a barb. Your IG can be very um, highlighted this week, okay? There could be a lot of people on your IG. You guys could be getting a lot of new followers. Nine of Cups, yep. Getting the recognition that you've been deserving, okay? Especially if you want, like, a lot of, you, if you want a social media, your social media presence is heightening, okay? And you look the fuck good. You're generating prosperity. Damn, that card flew all the way over there. I'm hearing break from Toronto, okay? Two of Wands in reverse, okay? We have, somebody has the wrong intentions, okay? You guys could be working on your body, your figure, okay? Body, yaddy, yaddy, Meg could be very um, significant. Also, um, get a Meg, get a Meg, get a Meg, get a Meg, get a Meg. Go glow, go glow, go glow. Get them glow, all right? Yeah. Turn the wigs like iffy. You can get your week turned like iffy. The fool, the hangman, the ten of swords, the devil. Oh. Somebody is just in love with you and obsessed with you because you're in the industry, but they're hurt by you at the same time because you walked away from them. With the two of cups, 22 could be your age or an important number. You could be born on the 22nd. The magician could be a Virgo wanting to... Um, communicate with you but you no longer want to deal with this person you walked away from this person okay and if there was a virgo that walked away from you trust me you finally once you finally stopped caring that's when they wanted to come back towards you Seven of Pentacles, it's time to enjoy your investments. Enjoy the fruits of your labors because something is coming in, you guys. This week, something's coming in, so be prepared for that, okay? 
but yes be mindful of somebody trying to make you like compete for a spot but you already won already won your broad wave featuring little dark i already won you already won all right yeah those are you guys with the messages i love you guys so much don't forget to like the video comment share and subscribe make sure you guys check out your mid-monthly reading okay it will be posted today as well too so be ready bye